June 16, 1963, Croton on Hudson, a small river town in Westchester County, New York, got a front seat to history courtesy of acclaimed resident Lorraine Hansberry. Her activist roots took hold in Croton on Hudson, where 60 years ago she chaired an event at Temple Israel of Northern Westchester called the Rally to Support the Southern Freedom Movement. This rally took place during a time of turmoil in the United States, just two months before the March on Washington. Did you personally meet or know Lorraine? Yeah. Uh, and uh, I guess there aren't a lot of people left who could actually say that. My husband and I invested in her second play, The Sign in Sidney Roosting's Window. Yeah, there was, the, the rally was memorable for a lot of reasons. Um, and as I remember, the, the temple was packed. My late husband, Bill Cotton, was a teacher, and one of his students, Andy Goodman, was one of the three. He eventually went to the South with two other young men in a car that had been bought with money at that meeting. And they were murdered in Mississippi. She would be speaking out about all kinds of injustice that we find in different ways. Um, the, um, the Black Lives Matter movement would, would have resonated with her totally. Uh, the um, uh, women's rights movement, uh, you know, the, that, that, that really hadn't even got off the ground when, when, when she died, but she would have definitely been, been, been a part of that.